Alrighty guys, what's up? Welcome to another video. We're on the PBE playing the new Aurelian Soul Rebirth. He's got all new abilities on the passive and it, they all look so freaking cool. His new kit is so cool. I love it. And yeah, let's go over the abilities. He's got a new passive called Cosmic Creator where basically uh, his when he damages enemies with abilities, he collects Stardust which improve his abilities and you can pause here and uh, see the improvements to the abilities if you'd like. Um, his Q fires a Breath of Starfire for up to 3.25 seconds and deals damage per second. And per level, it like scales up and can like go through, like pierce through minions. It gets blocked. But yeah, Aurelian Soul loves front to back fights with his new Q. His DPS is crazy. He's basically a high skill cap. Uh, scaling DPS mage now, which I love. That is my play style. I, uh, I'm an Azir main. I love Cassiopeia and champs like that. Um, our W is the old E, where we fly in a direction, but we get to cast our Q during it. Okay, he cancels our Q with a Z. Yeah, we also get a uh, damage bonus while we are flying, and we can cast our Q and E, and they're even our ult. Yeah, the E, it basically spawns a circle that uh, slows and like pulls in enemies in the center. And it also executes them when they're below like 5% HP in the early game and it scales up. So yeah, we're gonna put a point in that second. We max Q, then E, then W. And the ult spawns like... It throws a giant star at them which like knocks them up and it like scales with Stardust into a global ultimate. And there's even like a really funny easter egg that goes along with it. Um, he can, instead of a giant star, he can throw in a Storm Dragon Lee Sin. If you pay attention, you may be able to see that this game. We'll see though. But yeah, we just want to uh, scale up. We've got first strike, magical footwear, minion D mat to help with the farming. Well, he's the Z, so I'm gonna use our Q on him here. See how gets pulled in right there? Nice. Hey, there's the jungler. Yeah, we got Mean Demod, Cosmic Insight, Offsuit Focus, and Gathering Storm. He's got pretty decent AP scalings. His Q has 60%. Oh, I'm kind of griefing it. <laughs> ah! My bad, my bad, my bad. I thought I could finish him off there. The greed got to me. The greed got to me, boys. I'm sorry. Mabba. Alrighty, well, we're gonna buy a tier now. Uh oh. Oh, that's winnable. Nice. Okay. Anyways, forget I just hinted that. Yeah, even if you have a bad early game on this champion, you should never tilt because you scale so strong. He pretty much has like infinite scaling. His ult can be like the size of the entire map, but like, uh, like once he like scales up with Stardust, it basically sends out a shockwave that hits everyone on the map. Yeah, the uh, combo is R, E, and then Q. Your ult will set up your E uh, crowd control. Ah. Get out of the Q slow on me so I couldn't dodge his E. Yeah, his early game is pretty weak. I believe he starts scaling once he gets like Lost Chapter, level 9. And then uh, I think we're gonna go crown this game. Since they have a Kha'Zix and Kassadin and Silas who will jump into me, I think Crown would be the best mythic for this game. And then we'll do Seraphs into like Rabadon, Zonias, etc. Uh -oh. Okay, here we use the combo. Okay, oh my god. We live with like no HP. Thank goodness, man. Well done, Mr. Lee Sin. Thanks for helping out my lane. Got a nice little CS lead now. Yeah, I cannot help in this fight because I have 100 HP. Oh, he wins those. Yeah, Lee Sin just got a buff on the PvE. His uh, Q does like 10% more damage. It scales 10% more AD. And his E scales harder, which is pretty cool. Alrighty, now we want to go for the Lost Chapter. We're gonna need that crown so we can just sit there and DPS with the crown shield while they try to all-in me. They will lose the all-in once we have that shield. And we'll get an extra shield from Seraphs. 
But yeah, you need the champion's really, really mana hungry. His Q costs uh it costs more mana every time you level up up to 65 mana per second. So that's why you should go mana mythic and then probably seraphs. And you won't have really any mana problems. Yeah, since he can just E me and take like 60% of my HP in one trade, we're going to wait for the wave to uh come into us here. We're gonna let our E like execute the minion. Yeah, whenever you have a giant wave pushing into you like this, it is best to just sit back, not take any bad trades, and farm under your tower. I wanna like try to pull the wave here like this. Okay, this is a angle Silas can roam, so he's probably roaming. Yeah. Yeah. He's not level six. Wait a second. Yeah, let's go see if we can punish that. We're gonna boss going over and save our W. Yeah, he knows I'm coming. Oh wait, what? Oh, the Silas was there. I didn't even see. I didn't even know the Silas was there, man. I only saw the Kha'Zix walk in. We got an assist though. That's good. Get the lost chapter now. Guys, we're slowly becoming a champion. We're slowly becoming a champion. If I post this, that means I scaled up in 1v9 the game. Oh, that doesn't look like a good fight. Kate's playing around her trap so well. Okay, now he can maybe go in, but Kate has E. So I think healing in is still dangerous. Tom can just hear now though, and Tom has ult. Oh, he's out of energy. Ooh, nice ult. Yeah, I played this uh, Silas matchup twice now on PBE, and it's like it's pretty hard early, but once we get like one item, we start to win this matchup. Nice, that was a good slow. That got me some uh, first try gold. Yeah, I can just blast him with uh, my Q whenever his E is down. Cooldown on the Q is extremely short. Let's give him a hard time here. Okay, see, we're scaling, boys. We're scaling. That's some ridiculous damage right there, man. He cannot play the game after that. Oh my gosh. So now what we want to do now that we've chunked him is freeze the wave and like make him push up. Got the ult coming back in 30. Maybe I should have let him hit that, but I don't know, he heals too. I'm gonna go in here. Dodge that, that's good. Oh, are you kidding me? Dude, oh my gosh, like... Can I just 1v1 the mid laner, man? Just like, ah. Uh, I hate bugs. What a pest. It's a jungler's game, man. League of Legends Season 13, it's a jungler's game, baby. It's alright, though. Team is holding down the early game, and we scale. I think I'm gonna head for a bot lane gank here, with Lee Sin roaming down. Should be able to clean up this dive. Oh, he's taking the kills. I want it. Alright, we're gonna W through the wall here. Use the E. Hit the R. Okay, we hit a zoning R. Nice, we got the kill. We're in the game now, we're in the game. We should take this wave. Shall attempt to. Alrighty. Oh yeah, no, no, I go back mid here. I'm still up in CS, that's good. Uh, like I want the blue, but I don't know man, like the wave is right here. It's kind of bad timing. Okay, it made an EOA. Oh, Leona was ganking. I needed the pink from her. I didn't know she was going in. What the hell are we doing, boys?
Our Ash is really low, so maybe a fight here would be bad. Fight him here if Lee Sin comes. Nice, cool. Oh, freaked up my cannon, man. Holy moly, that guy came out of nowhere, but we got the kill. We're scaling up. The hard part of the game is over, guys. We're becoming a champion. It's worth several champions. I think it'd be really cool if we could like queue the tower. Oh, it's sick. We still got that plate, I think. Alrighty, we got 52 Stardust. And our ult is scaling too. 33 out of 75. Alrighty. Oh, uh, yeah. We should go crown this game for sure. Their burst damage is really gross. But now we can work on the Seraphs. I'll buy some HP. Now we're really tanky and we can just stand still and blast them with our breath. With our stank breath. Oh, he does bot tower, so their mid's gonna roam here now. Their bot's gonna lane mid. Alright, let's see. Can we get the insect? Beautiful. Well, Steve, well played. That was a great setup. Oh, and he's still going. Is it a rift out angle? If Kha'Zix walks into us here, wouldn't we have Leona? I think we kind of just one-shot him. Oh, he's coming. Have him face check this. Get him, get him, get him. Where did he go? Leona? Or oh, Leona got juked really hard, apparently. In him the ult, and the kill is stolen. That's unfortunate. Let's head top and try to punish Kassadin or Lee. We'll go for, I mean, Kassadin's like really hard to get because he's so many dashes. Okay, going in. Oh, I got cancelled. Okay, I tried to sidestep that, but it didn't work. Pop the barrier, nice! Blasted her. Let's freaking go. Oh crap. Uh damn. Aviona couldn't save me. Alrighty, well. Ooh, he hit the Silas. Leona needs to get out of the way though. <laughs> okay, nice, nice, nice. Alrighty. Candle gem here. Does that spell out a large rod? I think it does. It does. I don't want to sell anything though. I could sell my Zorn's ring. Yeah, I guess. I mean, honestly, that's worth. I get way more damage if I do that. So we should do that. Okay, sick baits. Man, he's really tanky. What the hell? He's actually just BMing them. Oh my god, nice. Okay. Hit it with the ult. Okay. Oh, I can get the Ari kill? Damn. Honestly, it's fine. I'm happy our jungler and top performed this game so that we could scale. Because the early game of this champion is really hard. 
But also, like, it feels like it doesn't matter if I have a bad early game. Scaling champs are too good in this meta, where bounties are just everywhere. So many comeback mechanics. Alrighty, let's... Oh. I'm blasting? Okay, I don't want to go too far in. The DPS in. Oh my gosh. Couldn't kill the Ari. Alright, that's unlucky. <laughs> well, we have our Seraphs now. It's quite good. We got ourselves a game here. This will go to late game. We may be able to get six items this game and show you the power of full build Aurelian Soul. And trust me, it is looking pretty broken. And enemy team kind of BM. Question marks? Come on. He's gonna learn some manners. We got a deep flank from the Tom Kench. And this guy actually just dove our 04 Ash. I think we could type a question mark after that. That was pretty troll. Yeah, there's just like non-stop perma fighting on TV. I love it. Alright, I think I'm gonna go to the blue buff now. We don't really need the siege man. Just clear the wave. I mean, it is kind of wave. We probably could have. Oh well. Committing to the blue buff. Open it, mana. Gimme, gimme. Oh. Seems enemy team spawned and punished them for that dive. Ooh, we got Castle and Scaling in the top lane. He's got Heart Steel, so he's really tanky. He's level 12. Hey, what is he building? His Catalyst? I think he's doing Abyssal Mask here and then like... Seraphs or whatchamacallit? Hunter's Approach? I forgot what it's called. Oh, hey. His ult is down for a second. Wow, he is tanky. Okay, Castle and Q cancels my Q, so it looks like I encountered. Yeah, now that we have like our Q maxed, our breath actually goes through the minions. Use the E for the execute. Nice, we yoinked the kill. Dude, like, I love that he has an execute on his Z. You can just secure kills. Wish uh, my main champion Azir had something like that. It's really hard to secure kills on him early game. Like, that is like such a nice thing to have as a scaling mage. Sometimes so, dude. Okay, we got a large ult coming. Boom! Bomba! Holy, that's so sick, man. Team? You need the charge, please? Fuck. Where is he? Okay, we got him. Nice. The executes. We have a built-in collector, man. I freaking love that. We're going in. We're still blasting. Okay, that's so cool, man. I love this champ's kit. That's too cool. There. You don't want it? Alright, I'll get 5 gold. Alright, I think we reset and go dragon here. It's a pretty close game, but we're starting to win team fights. Oh crap, I have 3k gold right now. Okay, enemy doesn't have any MR, so I'm gonna do Shadow Flame. Morello would be decent, but I think I'll do Shadow Flame instead. 
I don't think Silas would be like healing that much in these fights. We'll get more damage from Shadow Flame. I think I'm gonna head mid and catch that wave and then rotate the dragon. And the dragon's gone. JK. They got there first. Okay, they'll get we get a fat wave here. Please don't touch it. Are you serious? <laughs> wow. Rude, man. I even think that. Oh shit, we're getting assassinated back here. That's a good pick from them. Shab is so freaking cool, but like he has some awkwardness in the fact that you have to like stand still like during your Q. Alright, here's the combo. Nice. Oh, wait, my dubby's back up. We're going in. We're sending in the ult. It's a stun. Oh, come on, really? I guess she lives. I guess she lives. Okay. Don't block it. Thank you. My crown is saved. Alright. Oh, this is not the sea jingle. We wanna back up here. Overextended boys. Oh shit, okay, we're going in. Alright, we stayed behind Tom Kench. Dodge the Ari abilities. Lash away from the Kha'Zix. Panic barrier into nothing. Oh, that's a fat knockup over there. They were just playing this fight slow. Kassadin wants to engage on us. I'm running out of mana. I think it's a reset angle here. Yeah, we like. I didn't want to overstay mid, but. I had to. Alrighty, we got 413 AP, sick. I like the absolute focus gathering storm combo, you get so much AP. Champion doesn't really need much haste because your Q is like always up. You can just like... So, I think that's why absolute focus is better than transcendence on this champ. Oh, I should have took the gate. So I will make it to this fight. Good Ash. Oh, that charm hits. Ooh. Alrighty, we hit a fat ult on them. I think I'm gonna try and get out from this fight. Alright, nice. Have to play very smart in these team fights so we don't get exploded by the multiple assassins they have and fed AD carry. There's someone right here, no? We need to fix our ways, like why are we in river for no reason? Oh, Kha'Zix is getting caught in our jungle, hopefully. Coming. Okay, run a W in the river, see what's going on here. He's under the turret. Honestly, it's diveable. Up Goblin. Ah, uh, okay. <laughs> okay. Cool. Yeah, as you can see, the first right gold is starting to like add up a lot. Let's see here behind the wall, out of vision, and just blast this Baron. Look at this DPS we're doing. This late game DPS is looking gross. And that's with a crown instead of a Ludens. I think Ludens is his best like damage mythic. And then like the Andres if you're against tanks. Alrighty, um... Yeah, he has like really good synergy with his Q with Ludens. He like reduces the uh, Ludens cooldown. Pretty fast. With his uh, DPS abilities. Alright. 
Alrighty. Um. Coleman. Play it slow, play with a front line. Okay. We're going in. Oh, are you kidding me, bro? I got. What CC'd me there? I was about to use my E. I got CC'd by something, but I don't know what. My E didn't go off because I got CC'd. Anyway. That's unlucky they got to live. Alright, we should have just played for the dragon here instead of like over chasing like that. We got a bit hyphy, we got a bit greedy. We thought we could do it, but the enemy is also disgustingly fed with three items, so our greed was punished. That is one tanky castle right there. He's no resistances though, so Lee Sin's kinda just one shotting him. Oh. There goes Lee Sin. He still defend the dragon though. He did some good damage there. I'm coming. I'm on my way. Hey, what? Who's this? No way, that's so grief. Punish it. Okay, my health's almost up. Oh, what the hell, man? I need some peel. Where's my front line? They're so deep. Really? Bro. Heal, please. Jeez, man. These fights are too chaotic. Okay, we all need a group. This is becoming a very difficult game. Damn, they're getting every dragon. That is not good for us. We can't let them get this Hextech soul. That soul is too broken. Alright, I'm gonna go top and get the XP. Atomize are doing really good this game, even though we like, have just been like permafighting and not really farming. I mean, skirmishing is like pretty solid for a uh, scaling mage. As long as your teammates have like early game damage or CC, he seems pretty good. <laughs> cool. Uh oh. Let's try to punish this. Oh, the ER just freaking obliterates them, man. They can't move. Wait, someone's going in. Oh, that's a Cassidy. Okay, our base is kind of getting fucked. Wait, what? Okay, we barrier. Ooh, nice! Okay, that's a fast shutdown. We have a Rabadon now, guys. We have a Rabadon. That's sick. Alright, hopefully Kassad and Kha'Zix don't come and kill me right here. That'd be really unfortunate. Wait, did they get the Baron? Oh, when did they get Baron? <laughs> Alrighty, ready? Bye. Hmm. I think I'll get Zonia's. I wanted to buy an elixir here, but I kind of want to save it for Zonia's. Definitely need a Zonia's further dive. Just like buy some time for my frontline to come back and peel for me. Alright, I'm gonna try and get blue buff here. It's up. Awesome. Dude, I love that the E just like. Perma CC's the blue. It's so nice. Just snares him. Alright, in our jungle. Oh, what the hell? Just over the wall. We just did 700 damage to that guy. We're going in. Where is he? Dude, like... What? Oh, wait. Oh, shit! My Q tracked him there. Nice. Alright, we're gonna go over here. What the heck is even going on here? 
I'll be honest, like 1v1 running the Silas up here. Oh, whoops. Oh, that's bad. Oh, never mind. This is good. Oh, yeah, that's really good. <laughs> Dude, I did not expect him to be right there. Okay, we chased the Kaylin here. Oh, she gale forced out of my E. Nice. Dude, this champ's damage is so good late game. That early game felt pretty rough, but... I don't know, like... I think, in general, you're just going to have a rough early game early in Soul if you try to fight. For your mythic item. Either you snowball 1d9 the game, or... You have to play catch up in... 1d9 like an extra 5 minutes later. Oh, wait. I'm full build. Alright, ah, uh, should I get rid of this Dark Seal? Yeah, I think I need Zonians, that would be smart. I think Zonians is the move here. Further dive. Okay, we have 927 AP, oh my gosh. 5v5 mid, I'm... I'm full build, let's go. This is it, guys. Final showdown. Send it like who cares if Cassidy is splitting? He's not gonna do that much damage to turrets. Yeah, I kind of just want to send it in. That was fine. Oh, that's a lot of damage. Nice, and then let's chase this guy. Oh, ho! what? That's awesome! Don't use. See, bro, they want me so bad. They wanted me so bad. Let's freaking go. We smurfed that fight. Dude, this champ is too cool, guys. Like, I'm for real. Like, I'm going to main him. I want to main this champ. He's going to be, like, my second most played champ. Okay, we need to focus on ending. Oh, and then, then, then. Oh, crap. Okay. Cast still up, though. I think I have to leave. It's not ending, though, unfortunately. Yeah, if we all die here, they'll get Dragon and Baron, so we just want to back up. Oh, uh, maybe we can run to this and burst it? Let's see. Oh, nice. Cast still pouring top. Who cares about that? We need to stop them from getting this dragon. Okay, yes, we're melting this thing. We're melting it. We're melting it. Nice. Oh, we denied them the soul, guys. We denied them the soul. That's huge. Oh, my. Dude, I'm in love with this champion's kit. Thank you, Riot Games. I think this is the best rework ever. It's so badass. It's so cool. Alrighty. If we catch out this Silas, it'd be huge. I want to take the gate and try to flank him. Go, 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 go. Nice. Good pick. Okay, same thing. Go mid in the game. And it's 4v5, so we want to end this. Dude, like, I just want to send it on this Caitlyn. Sick! Mm, end or chase? Definitely end. I still have Cassid and Kha'Zix up. Let's push this in. And threaten the end and maybe they'll come back and we can fight them. Ooh, Kha'Zix, what's up bruh? Yeah, Izzy is down for a bit. Like my team, the group here. Silas is back. Beautiful Ash ult, well done. Still no. Boom! Oh, we freaking just nuked everyone on the Nexus. Alrighty, guys, GG's. This champ is so freaking sick. Should try him out on the PBE.
And uh, expect more Aurelian Soul content from me after this video, guys. If you enjoyed the video, please body the like button, body the subscribe button for more daily content. And uh, let's check out the Jamish chart. We had a rough early game, but oh my gosh. The champion scales so freaking hard as soon as he like finishes like one item. 58k damage, 35 minute game. That's a lot. Alrighty, guys. Peace out. Hope you have a wonderful day. Later.